Hi, I'm Lisa Evans, Scotland and Arsenal football player, and I'm going to show you what I eat in a day. Here goes. Mm. Mm. Sweet. Can't start the day without a little cup of tea. Yeah. I'm really rubbish at eating fruit and veg, so. This is good to have in the morning and gives me that extra burst of energy before training. I always have this smoothie because it's got loads of fruit in it and it's healthy because it's smoothie. Scottish. Only Scottish ones. Yum, 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 yum. Porridge. This is what I eat every single morning before training. Some bananas in there, porridge and a sneaky little bit of Nutella. Um, sometimes I have honey, I just mix it up, but I always have porridge because it's got a lot of carbs in it and makes me feel good for training, so... Have you ate something already? I don't know, but I'm going to eat the Okay. <gasps> Food! Okay, so I've just been on the pitch, um, going in for lunch at the club. We always eat lunch at the club, which is amazing. <laughs> And it's always different stuff, so chicken, fish. So let's see what they've got today. Mm. Is that Thai curry? I'm having that for dinner tonight. Damn it. You know what? You've got everything I like on Yes, Monday. why? Can I have chicken, please? Yeah. The lasagna looks good. Get my carbs in again. Pasta. Get my greens in. Mm. I need a nice pineapple pot. Ah, decent. So I am making my very special red Thai curry. Here's my Thai curry paste. Coconut milk. Um, this is the chicken and vegetable. So that is one pepper and one onion. I'm gonna cook the sauce in this pan, then add it all together, and it's gonna taste amazing. I love it. Um, it tastes good, and it's good for you because it's got a lot of vegetables in it and protein and chicken. I don't really have this before training because it's quite heavy, but I really like it after training. So. Need to make the sauce first. Oof, that's runny. Coconut milk. Putting this on. Oof, sorry. Dream on me. Okay, so this is the coconut milk. Gonna cook it up for a little while. Okay, Em's has also cut up some nice broccoli here. So yeah, broccoli, a pepper, and an onion. You can put any veg that you want in, but I always use that veg because I like it. So this is some chicken stock I've made. Just like a third of a cup. Oof, that looks juicy. Okay, curry paste going in. You can add as much as you like, depending on how hot you like it. Ems, how hot do you like it? No roasting. Okay, I'll try that first. Two spoons of brown sugar. That makes it nice and sweet. Then two spoons of fish sauce. Give that a little stir, a little taste. Just had a little taste. Tastes amazing. Okay, this is my chicken stock going in. Ems, you're gonna love this. Now is a good time to add the broccoli because it needs longer to cook. So I'm shoving it in. I'm just leaving this to simmer to let the broccoli cook for a little while longer, so. Okay, so I'm gonna add this chicken, onion, and pepper now to the main guy. Plenty of veg, anyway, Ems. Oh, we're almost ready. Obviously, I've got tons of veg, tons of chicken in there because I want to get as much food in me as possible, especially after training today. Um, it's important to eat a lot and recover well, so I've got a lot of meat in there and a lot of veg, but. It'll be worth it and it'll taste amazing. We're having it with some nice healthy brown rice. This is it. Can't wait to eat it. How is it, Ems? Really nice. Yeah? Yeah. Out of 10, what would you give it? 10. Okay, so you've heard about my Thai curry recipe. 
if you guys have got any comments or if you like this um, or if you want to get me any tips or advice making this Thai curry then let me know let me know what your favourite meals are um, if you've got any inspiration for me to make or cook hit me up in the comments below